Hi guys, how are you? I hope you all are fine. Now I am going to teach here remaining LAQs in first chapter. This chapter is related to the second year. Okay, the related the, the remaining third LAQ is there is a how the stationary waves are formed in closed pipe. This one, and we have to find out the different modes of frequencies. So we have to find out the here relation between the frequencies, sir. Okay. Now, first of all, how the stationary waves are formed in closed pipe? That is our LAQ first one. So I am ready here directly. Answer. See here. Directly, I am ready here. Closed pipe. Closed pipe. In that closed pipe, how the stationary waves are found in closed pipe? That means, whenever, first of all, what is a closed pipe? Closed pipe means nothing but a pipe which has a pipe which has one end is closed and another end is open. Okay, a pipe which has one end is closed and another end is open that is called here closed pipe in that closed pipe when you, when the air it can be travel into this open pipe in this open pipe it can be formed here see in this pipe when the air can be travel so nodes are formed at the closed end Nodes are found at the closed end and anti nodes are found at the open end. Okay? Once again, I will tell you, sir. When the air can be travel into this closed pipe, in this closed pipe, the nodes it can be formed here at the closed end of the pipe and the anti nodes are it can be formed here at the open end of the pipe. Okay? This is called here closed pipe. And the distance between two consecutive means the distance between two consecutive node and anti node is that is lambda by two. But we are taking here the distance between one node and one anti node is this distance is that is L is equal to lambda by four. This is the L is equal to lambda by four sine one. Okay, L is equal to lambda by four because of the distance between two consecutive node. Our anti node is that is lambda by two, but we are taking here the distance between one node and one anti node is that is lambda by four. Okay, now in that one first harmonic frequency we can take here that is fundamental harmonic frequency. Okay, first harmonic, first harmonic frequency. This is the first harmonic frequency, sir. And now see here. In this frequency, it can be found how many nodes, how many anti nodes are these? See here. First of all, n is equal to one frequency is called here first harmonic frequency. And in this frequency, it can be found one node and one anti node. So one node and one anti node. One node and one anti node. It can be found in this. Five. Okay. And next one, the distance between two consecutive means the distance between one node and one anti node is that is lambda by four. That value we can get here. L is equal to lambda by four. And again, lambda is equal to four into L, four L. According to the speed of the wave formula, everyone you know this one. That is, but according to the speed of the wave formula, V is equal to L lambda. And from this formula, we can write here frequency value that is n is equal to n is equal to v by lambda. So this is the first harmonic frequency. That's why we are taking here n suffix one. N one is equal to v by lambda value is that is four L. This frequency is called here first harmonic frequency or fundamental frequency. Don't forget this one. Okay. And next one, sir. And the next one, second harmonic frequency. But in that closed pipe, we we are not having here second harmonic frequency. Means it has only odd numbers one, 
3, 5, like this only can be consist here frequencies. So in that frequencies, so next one we can take here, n is equal to 3 frequency is called here third harmonic frequency because of 5 we are reading sir here second one sir we see second one I am drawing here one diagram when the waves it can be travel in this pipe so it can be found here two nodes and two anti nodes it can be found here two nodes and two anti nodes. The distance between again same like this only we have to take the distances. Then only it is possible. This one which frequency we can find easily. See the distance between node to anti node. Here also node to anti node. This distance is here lambda by 4 and anti node to node is this distance also lambda by 4 and node to anti node is this distance also lambda by 4. The total distance is that is L is equal to 3 lambda by 4. That is L is equal to 3 lambda by 4. In that formula, again we have to take that one. So in this frequency, it can be found how many nodes? Two nodes and two anti nodes. Okay. And now see here, this distance we have, we have to take here. L is equal to that is 3 lambda by 4. You, 4 it will be taken by is equal to this side it will be multiplied into length 4 into L 4 L is equal to 3 lambda then again 3 la no, lambda is equal to 4 L by 3 but everyone you know speed of the wave formula again we have to take here but speed of the wave formula that is V is equal to N lambda okay and now see here from this formula n is equal to v by lambda this is a which frequency this is a third harmonic frequency how can we determine sir means how many distance it can become here three times three distance it can become that's why it is a third harmonic frequency so we can write here n3 is equal to v by lambda value is that is 4l by 3 in the denominator when it will become fraction that denominator value it, can be, it will be multiplying with numerator so this 3 it will be goes to multiplying with v so we can write here n3 is equal to 3 into v by 4l so again n3 is equal to 3 into here v by 4l from the equation 1 from the equation 1 from the equation we can write here n3 is equal to 3 n1 so this is the third harmonic frequency formula okay and now see here another one and next one one is there and third harmonic frequency and next one is fifth harmonic frequency so in this frequency we can take here same diagram sir we have first of all we have to draw the diagram then only this part we can find easily So, see here, guys. See here, guys. See, it can be found here. 3 nodes 1, 2 and 3 3 nodes and 3 anti nodes 1, 2, 3 so in this 5th harmonic frequency it can be consist here 3 nodes and 3 anti nodes now again we have to write the here distance is between 1 node and 1 anti node the distance between 1 node and 1 anti node is that is lambda by 4 and again same 1 node anti node 2 node is that one also lambda by 4 and node to anti node is that one also lambda by 4 and anti node to node is that one also lambda by 4 and uh, and next one node to anti node is that one also lambda by 4 total it can become total how many distance are mean that is l is equals to 5 lambda by 4 1 2 3 4 5 so it can become here total 5 distances so that's why it is a fifth harmonic frequency 
in this frequency it can be consist here three nodes and three anti nodes don't forget this one and next one in this frequency we can write again same as it is the distance you can take here l is equal to 5 lambda by 4 then 4l is equal to 5 lambda then lambda is equal to 4l by 5 this is the wavelength lambda is equal to that is 4l by 5 where lambda is the wavelength sir don't forget and now see here but according to the speed of the wave formula is v is equal to n lambda and from this formula we can write here that implies n is equal to v by lambda so this is the fifth harmonic frequency that's why we are going to write here n suffix phi is equal to v by lambda means nothing but that is lambda means nothing but that is 4l by 5 so this why it is again to be multiplying with numerator then we can write here n phi is equal to phi into v by 4l v by 4m so that implies again we can write here that implies that is equal to that is equal to we can write here phi n1 so according to the first equation because of here n1 is equal to v by 4m so that's why we can write here n phi is equal to phi n1 and and also guys see here along with this question definitely 100% you will get here one problem this problem I will teach in the next video okay I will teach in the this is a part one and for the part two you have to see in the next video okay and also see guys see here please like and share my channel and subscribe everyone please subscribe my channel share and like okay thank you bye